economy must work for the benefit of people. But he came into government and found that many states were not able to pay their workers. He didn't just lament it, as Governor Bagudu rightly reminded us. He provided bailout, regardless of party divide. Not once, not twice, not three times, more than that. To provide federal grants, even in the face of federal government's own limited resources, to ensure that states are able to meet one of their most basic responsibilities to workers of the state. Because when state governments default in the payment of salary, and for states that are dependent or referred to as civil service states, it is obvious that the people of those states tend to be negatively affected because with the civil servant not being paid salaries, he cannot pay his rent. And those who rely on rent collection won't be able to uh, won't have any source of income. Of course, those who sell tomatoes in the market, rice and beans, they can't sell those basic food items if the civil servants in those states have not been paid. President Buhari insisted not only lamenting it, but provided support to state governments to meet that basic obligation. If some state failed to do so, it is in spite of President Buhari's effort, because these are facts no one can dispute. So if they ask you, what are you going to compare with, tell them that in those states where Governors went into election, owed two years' salaries. Other Buhari, many of them were able to take advantage of those special grants to off offset those salaries, salary areas. But I think it's also fundamental, like I said earlier, to ask a question, which kind of great country do we want to be? Interrogating the character of that greatness. But President Buhari came in and said, we can't refer to Nigeria as a giant of Africa and lament the poverty of many people in our midst and go back to bed and sleep. And he created this social intervention fund that seeks to identify the poorest among us and have some cash transferred to them from time to time. This may not have solved the problem, but it does indicate the heart of a caring president, a father that worries about the 